So let's be clear on that. You're going to do those exercises uh, to remove your pain. And once you're out of pain, you can just do those exercises, either the standing one or those laying down ones. You can do them once a day, um, three or four times a week, just to keep the extension force into your back to keep a nice, healthy spine. Now, if you've found that those exercises, as I said, those exercises will be great for the majority of people, the vast majority. However, there are a few cases such as spinal stenosis and maybe anterior disc bulges where they actually pushed forward rather than backwards. Then these are what I'd like you to explore. So if you found that it peripheralized, your back was worse afterwards or your sciatic symptoms was worse, then what we're going to do is explore flexion exercises, especially for people with spinal stenosis. They, their backs don't like to have extension normally. They'll much prefer flexion. So this is what you do if you found that they were not uh, you did not get better or you got worse with those exercises, is flexion. Same thing, you're going to do them uh, every two hours if you've got back pain uh, until you're out of back pain and then you can just do them once or twice a day. So here's what you want to do. You're going to lay on your back and you're going to put your head down and bring your legs up like this to force flexion into your spine. Ten seconds and then back down. 10 repetitions, 10 second holds, just like that. Okay, 10 repetitions, 10 second holds, every two hours, six to eight times a day until you're out of pain. The other thing I want you to do is also just take, you can put your arms out if you're on the floor, and take your legs off to the side like this. Take them across to the side, and again, hold that for 30 seconds come back up and do the other side. Taking it across, 30 second hold. And then see what happens to your back pain. Same rules apply. See what happens to your back pain after you've done those. So that's your alternative. If the extensions made your symptoms worse, then you will do these flexion exercises, okay, to abolish your pain. That's what we're going to do, and you want to see the same things, a centralization or, or a decrease of pain, centralization of symptoms by doing those, and those are the exercises that you'll be doing instead.